What up, Bonnie Sports Network here, and this is one of the reasons why the Toronto Blue Jays are the worst fucking team in all of baseball and possibly sports. No, it's not. It's not. It's not the worst team in all of sports. All right, let's journey back to 2015. The Blue Jays are an up and coming team. They have Donaldson, Batista, and Carnacion, a young pitching staff. Um, a young pitching staff. And they trade for David Price and Tulowitzki. They go to the playoffs. They um, come back from the Rangers. Come back against the Rangers. Go to the uh, ALCS. Lose to the Royals. But, um, you know, this team's looking up. This team's looking up. This is a Blue Jays team that we haven't seen since 93 in the playoffs. Next year. Next year. Um, different team. No David Price. But um, still have... Basically almost the same hitting core. And Sanchez has become a starter. Stroman is fully healthy. And you have one of the best pitching core in pretty much Blue Jays history. One of the best pitching core. One of the best pitching best pitching in the league, in my opinion. Um, you have the ERA leader, Aaron Sanchez. He'll come up a little bit in this video. And then you pimp. You pimps up the Orioles in the wild card round with the Edwin Edwin walk off. You go to the DS and just again, <laughs> this was funny. Um, beat the Rangers, um, and then ALCS only get one win against the Indians that you were really heavy favorites against, and you're a wild card team. Okay, these are gonna be good. We're gonna sign Edwin, right? No. We signed Morales before we can even fucking get Edwin. And that's when the de decline happens. 2017 never finished over 500. Alright, here comes 2018. Donaldson. Alright, 2018. Um, 2018. Alright, 2018. Start off pretty strong in April. And then... Osuna with domestic and violence incidents. Dawson gets fucking hurt. And then there's your season there. Your season's over. You trade Osuna. You trade Dawson for fucking scraps. And you end the season pretty poorly. But you get 70 plus wins. Now you got this year. You start off 2-1. and one, Which is not really a good. Like, it's a good start. But you know it's not going to hold. And then month of April terrible. Month of Month of May, terrible. Month of June, terrible. You're one of the worst teams in the league. But, you know, what the Jays have is prospects. But what this team doesn't have is damn pitching. Fucking Clayne Richard. <coughs> Edwin Jackson. <coughs> um, Clay Buckled. <coughs> the starting pitching's been garbage since, um, since Schumacher got hurt. And, you know, the only good pitcher, pitcher in the rotation is Stroman and Thornton. Thornton, the only good pitcher in the bullpen is Romano and Giles. And, you know, the hitting can get streaky at times, but you never have, you know, you don't have that one power hitter. Gritchick's not really a big power hitter. Um, you know, Guerrero's struggling a little bit. He's not hitting home runs. But, um... You know, this team's going to probably finish, like, second last in the league. I think the J Orioles are going to do better than the Jays. At least the Orioles have a good park. When you look at the Jays, a park Rogers Center is garbage. When the ball hits the freaking surface, you see those pellets fall out into the damn sky. Um, You know, this team, it frustrates me because, you know, I like the Blue Jays. I love them. You know, when they get hot and streaky, it's freaking exciting when they're when they can't hit, they really can't hit. Like, they swing at everything, man. Um, when they can't pitch, they throw meatballs down the freaking zone. I mean, down the zone, and everyone can crush them. Um, especially last year with Marco Estrada. And uh, thank God he's gone. Um, and Aaron, sp speaking of Marco Estrada, Aaron Sanchez has become the new Marco Estrada. He's damaged goods. It doesn't matter healthy or hurt. Like, when he's hurt, at least he's not on the roster hurting the damn team. And when he's healthy, he's not pitching well. Like, 
He gave up seven runs versus the Yankees. Yeah, they're a good team, but he started off strong. He started off strong three innings, then Luke Voigt got it on, and then um, and then a three-run bomb by Hicks. Like that's the situation I don't like about this team. I know we we're we were dead in the water around that time, but I want to be. I want this team to try to fucking win, not like get blown out every time. Tomorrow's game, today's game's against the Royals, and they're probably gonna get blown out. Um, the Jays are the worst team in the league when the Marlins have a fucking better record than you. Um, there's problems. You know, you know. Um, the Jays are probably gonna finish last place or second last. Last. Um, they're tanking like either the tanking or they're that like or their pitching is just that shit. You know, the if there's uh, there's been upsides. You know, Gritchick's been playing good outfield and hitting. Guriel has become the best hitter on this damn team. Um, you know, even Guerrero early in the year was hitting good, but now he's just he's getting a lot of hits. He's getting base hits and like he's not getting home runs, but you know, he's still productive. And um, you know, Bichette's been playing I mean not Bichette, Biggio's been playing good. And like and Eric Sogart's been the GOAT. So um those are the positives, but other than that, like you don't on the field with wins is not positive. When I when I watch the Blue Jays pitch, I'm fucking scared. Um, you know, and this is why I think they're gonna be last place by the end of the year. And I said that they're gonna be last place over the Orioles, and no one no one agreed with me. No one agreed with me. But um, no, I guess I'm a delusional fan. That's all. Um, you know. I hope the Jays get better. I hope Guerrero becomes like a Mike Trout. I hope Biggio and Bichette, Smith, um, what's his name, Nate Pearson, those guys develop into studs for this team and become Canada's team all over again, not like we saw in 2015, 16, 93, 92. And, um, yeah, Bonnie Sparks and Eric out, man, um, you know, I'm still going to be watching Jays games. You know, I'm still going to go to Jays games. They're entertaining. I just, I'm just like sick and tired of this team being last place. And it's going to be last place. So, Bonnie Sportsman Rick signing out. Yeah, the Jays are not, not really like, good to watch, man.